Hey guys, so today I'm doing a video on how to make your waist smaller. So for all my fitnessy friends, you probably already know every single thing that I'm going to say in this video, but for those of you who may have just come across this video and you think you're going to find quick and easy tips to shrink your waist, I want you to know right away that your waist size comes down to genetics and you can't get your waist smaller than your genetic potential allows. So my waist at its smallest has been about 24 inches. So knowing my body, I could probably get it down to 23 and a half inches at the smallest, but that's just about as small as it's possibly gonna get. It's gonna be different for everyone. So what I'm gonna show you guys in this video is how to create the illusion of a smaller waist. So a lot of people are always asking and they do waist trainers and all these diets and everything, but it really comes down to genetics at the end of the day. But what you can do is build up your upper body and build up your lower body. So today we're gonna be talking about upper body and then if you guys really enjoy this video, give it a thumbs up and I will do one for lower body on how to create the illusion of wider hips in comparison to this smaller waist that you have created. So I'm gonna show you guys my favorite back exercises and shoulder exercises. These are the top exercises that I've been using ever since I started working out and they're exercises that I really enjoy. Some of them are a little more challenging than others, but they're definitely something that everyone can learn to do. Now, not all of these can be done at home because you do need to use a lat pull down for some of them or cable machines, but you can easily find a lot of back exercises and shoulder exercises that you can do at home as long as you have dumbbells. Basically any shoulder exercise can be done with dumbbells and a lot of back exercises can be done as well. So don't think that just because you don't have a gym that you can't achieve this look. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and let's get into it. Branches. So the first two exercises that I show you guys are lat pull down variations. So these are going to primarily work your lats with the synergist muscles involved being your rear delts, traps, rhomboids, biceps, brachialis, and your levator scapulae. So with the stabilization, you're going to be using your triceps and your rotator cuff in the wide grip and your biceps and your rotator cuff in the close grip. So your arms may feel like they are involved in the motion, which is normal. Just make sure that you aren't actually pulling the bar or attachment down using your biceps or your triceps. Make sure that you are using your lats. And how far you pull up is going to depend on you. I don't always extend all the way because of my shoulder mobility, but just extend until you feel like your lats have fully expanded and then contract them again as you do the motion. And keep a slight like 20 to 30 degree angle throughout the movement. So the third exercise is the seated row, and this is gonna mainly work your lats as well as the rhomboids of your upper back. So the synergist muscles for this exercise are going to be your upper back, traps, subscapular muscles, which is your teres major and minor, and then your rear delts. And the stabilizers will be your biceps and your rotator cuff. So the key with this is to not have a bicep pump at the end of the exercise, because that means that you are using your arms instead of using your back. So this last movement is something that I think everyone should do and it's the pull up. So this is going to primarily work your lats. Your synergist muscle involved is going to be your biceps. And when you do these, make sure you come all the way back down to the bottom. You guys will see on some of the reps I didn't and that's because I was actually dealing with a shoulder injury while I was filming this video. But normally I would come all the way back down to my starting position before I did another pull up. Oh. 